guys welcome back to another video my name is Sandra and today's video is about my favorite natural hair products under 10 pounds okay so I hope you enjoy but before we start it make sure you subscribe and hit that notifications button to get notified of all my new videos okay so let's just get into the video so I've categorized everything into shampoos you know deep conditioners and everything so I'm going to start with my shampoos so this shampoo is my favorite clarifying shampoo this is the um, nothing but clarifying shampoo I love this this has no petroleum mineral oil sulfates parabens colorants and Violet, I think it's called I'm not sure and then this one is the cream of nature argan oil now I'm not sure of this of the price. I think it's about five or six pounds I'm not exactly sure but I'll let you know on the screen somewhere where how much it is This is now the cream of nature with argan oil sulfur free moisture and shine shampoo. This is two pounds 99 probably one of the cheapest products I've ever bought and this is amazing I don't use this a lot so we've still got quite a lot left but I absolutely love it I think it's amazing um, for when your hair is feeling dry to have it um, to have a moisture shampoo is is really good the next thing we're going to talk about is conditioners and my this is my favorite favorite rinse out conditioner in the world it has a ton of slip a ton of slip in this product I love it and this is the Tresemme vitamin E luxurious moisture for dry or dull hair okay now um, this is about three pounds and it's 900 mil so you get a whole lot of products and it takes a long time to finish but at the moment I'm out of this I've got just a little bit left I have two bottles and I finished both so Another one of my favorites is this and this is the Tresemme Vibrant Naturals and this is the Nourish and Replenish Conditioner. I like this as well, it's not, I don't love it as much as I love this but when I'm out of this I go for this and this also smells really nice, both actually smell good. I can't open it, this is a new one, this is a new bottle so I can't. Yeah, I love the smell of both, and this is also two ninety nine. The third, the third conditioner I have is the As I Am Coconut Co Wash, and this I don't use it um, for myself too much. I use it every now and then. I don't co wash a lot, but for my baby's hair, this is amazing because, as I said, her hair, especially at the back, is so dry that um, I don't like to shampoo often on her hair i shampoo maybe about once every four weeks i think and um, most of the time it were co-washing just because of that dry hair at the back these are basically leave-ins and moisturizers okay so the first thing i have here is the lotter body curl and style milk so it says it defines curls tames frizz adds moisture and brilliant shine now i only picked this up what last week and I've only used it once for myself and once for my daughter as well. Lots of Body is a product that when I go to the, my local hair shop, I sort of pass by without even give, giving it a second look. And I don't know what uh, drew me to, to the, the shelf of Lotus Body this time, but I'm so glad, so glad I picked this up. I think this product is currently my holy grail leave-in conditioner and this is a little bit it's kind of, this is a little bit difficult for me to say because i am somewhat of a product junkie okay so I, I like to look for new products and try them so it's a little difficult for me to say with things that are my holy grail because i may find something next time that that may be my holy grail but this is amazing guys this is amazing it is so moisturizing the cream is quite thick can you guys see slightly thick so that's um good because it's like a leave-in and a cream at the same time it smells so lovely so nice i did this um twist when monday today's wednesday i did these twists on my hair um on monday when i was just i felt like my hair was dry so i went in and i moisturized 
with this alone usually i do the lco but i moisturize with this alone and then um, olive oil my hair has shine to it and it's very moisturizing when i took my twist out and i didn't even do the twist that like usually when i'm doing twists i'll do i know how i, I twist to get a slightly better result but i also have a like a basic twist for just you know twisting my hair because i'm just moisturized and i don't know what to do with my hair so i twist it up and so that's what i did but i think i've got a pretty good twist out with this so i'm really glad and for four pounds 29 i think it's really really good right okay so the next one is the Cantu um coconut curling cream now this for me i love it but my daughter's hair this is probably the holy grail for my daughter's hair to moisturize oh my god it feels like butter on her hair and even though her hair is low porosity but her hair loves this it loves this i can moisturize her hair with maybe any other leave-in with this and an oil and it will stay moisturized for the whole week. Okay. So the last moisturizer or shall I say a leave-in that I have is the Care Care leave-in conditioner. I, the last time I used Care Care products apart from this was when I was relaxed and I really, really love this. I'm surprised I'm going to pick it up in the, I know it has a larger bottle. I can't remember how much this was though, I believe it was either six or seven pounds this first one is the argan oil eco styler gel and this is the one i really love for sleeking my hair down or or just doing like buns in my for my edges i really love this this one now this how much is it i think this is either 3.99 or 4.90 it has a tag but i can't see properly i think it's about between two and four pounds i think and then this is the and Jackie's um, Don't Shrink Flaxseed Elongating Curling Gel and I really like this I don't like this for like putting my hair in a bun or for my edges I really love this for my wash and go now I haven't perfected my wash and go so far I've done like about three wash and goes um, and this is my favorite gel so far for it I don't think I've found like my holy grail products for a wash and go or I haven't even I don't really know how to get the best out of my hair or my curls when I do a wash and go, but I think it's a matter of time. The more you practice your wash and go, the more you'll be able to find the product that works for your hair. But this I really like for my wash and goes because it doesn't shrink up as any other gel I've used. My wash and goes, they shrink up, but maybe about 50 to 60 percent. Whereas if I was used to use something like this, I'd get about 70 percent and 80 percent off shrinkage. If you guys have any other product that you've used for your wash and goes and your low porosity girl, then let me know in the comment box, okay? Because I'm still looking for products that will work for my my hair when I do a wash and go. The next two things are the low to body star mean texturizing setting lotion and this is the elastic qp design foam and these two i really love for setting my hair when i'm doing my twist and curl braid and curl roller set any type of curl styles i'm doing these are the two to go for and this is 2.99 and i believe this is also about two or 3.99 i'm not sure the next things i have are deep conditioners and this is the Cantu um, deep treatment mask. I've done a review on this, so I'm going to link it somewhere so that you guys can have a look. And um, so I'm not going to talk about this much. But if you've watched the review, you guys know I love, love this. And the next one is the Aunt Jackie's Fix My Hair Intensive Repair Conditioning Mask. Okay, I've used this only once, so I can't say much about it yet. But so far, I really like it. I really like it. And this was £4.69, okay? And then the next deep conditioner is this. And this is one of my favorites. I've been using this since I was relaxed. And this is the olive oil, I'm sorry, this is the um, ORS, olive oil replenishing conditioner. And this is great um, for protein. When you want a protein deep conditioner, this is great. It's a light protein. And I really love it. And I love the fact that it's only what seven pounds twenty nine, and you get one liter, which is thirty three point eight fluid ounces. So this is huge. Okay. 
it's about the size of my head maybe it's huge so i really like i've had it for a while and i haven't run out yet so i really love this so the oils i have here is my coconut oil i love coconut oil i've loved coconut oil since i was a baby i'm sure because i grew up in ghana for those of you who don't know and coconut oil is like one of the staples for skin for cooking for everything basically we use coconut oil so i love coconut oil and this is the seven hills whole foods organic extra virgin coconut oil and this is a liter and it this is about eight i think i got it for eight pounds or 8.99 and this is a liter it's a huge bottle so Usually I get the 500 ml which is about half of this and I, I buy it for about eight pounds. So I thought when I saw this, I thought this is a bargain. So I grabbed it up and I really, really, really love it. Then the next thing is the Sunny Isles Jamaican Black Castor, Jamaican Black Castor Oil. <laughs> okay. And this, of course, like we, I'm sure we all know that it's a, it's a great oil for growing your hair. And this I got for $8.99, I think okay of course i have lots more oils all these products i'm talking about have lots more products that are affordable or under 10 pounds that i could talk about but i didn't want this video to be too too long so i didn't want to bring a whole lot in the next thing which is the last thing um is shea butter now shea butter is so cheap in ghana i don't buy my shea butter here in the uk i always get when I travel to Ghana, I bring it myself or when my, I ask my mom to give me, send me some um, shea butter and then she always sent. And so I've had this, this was much bigger than what it is now and I've used it and I've used it God knows how long now. But I love shea butter for my hair. This whole shea butter, when I got it, it was about twice this size and this is all I have left. And this is probably about five pounds in Ghana all of this or sorry sorry the size i had before i started using it was about more i would i'm sure it wouldn't be more than five pounds okay so shea butter is really cheap in ghana and i love it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and um make sure you subscribe and thumbs up rate and comment and please comment because i do reply so make sure you comment and i shall see you in the next one take care bye